Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason Newland This is going to be a stress and pain relief podcast So basically the thought behind this podcast and the episodes is that the same technique or techniques can be used for both reducing chronic pain and reducing stress. The, te- the same technique can have the same benefit or equal benefit for those issues. Sometimes I will focus on a particular part of the body and I'll put that in the title so you know. So maybe, you know, for example, stress and chronic pain in your neck. Uh, so you know. But other times there will be, it'd be just general. So this recording, I'm going to focus on relaxation. And from my own professional experience, going back to 2006, uh, when I used to offer a free pain relief service, uh, I used to see people in person, and they'd, they'd come for various different issues, whether it's uh, fibromyalgia, uh, arthritis, uh, RSD, uh, or RD, RSD, yeah, um, spinal issues, back pain, headaches, migraines, phantom limb pain, although in my opinion it shouldn't be called that because that's a it's almost uh in the in the title it's almost dismissing it you know it's almost saying oh it's so it's just phantom um so i've got experience with chronic pain as well as relaxing i spent a long time online making relaxation sessions and sleep sessions as well and because pretty much 99% of a sleep recording is relaxation and really you could say the same, even maybe 95%, sometimes it's maybe even 100% of a pain release session is relaxation. But with, you know, with maybe other the suggestions and guidance about that specific pain condition. So this is going to be a, a general you could say vague relaxation session as far as as you listen now to my voice um, you may have chronic pain in a certain part of your body you may have stress that you can really feel it in a certain part of your body now what I'm going to do with this recording is focus on relaxing your body generally generalized relaxation
and there's lots and lots of ways of getting to the same destination lots of ways of finding yourself starting to calm down some people may find that actually by listening to my voice listening to my words closing your eyes and relaxing in a comfortable chair maybe you're lying down on your bed your mind naturally starts to slow down Now I can, I can make out that it's some kind of magical thing, but the simple fact is that you stopped doing whatever it was that you were doing before, that may, may have been contributing towards the stress levels in your body and mind which was therefore contributing towards any physical discomfort that you were experiencing now as you listen to my voice and with your eyes closed your senses change how you experience the world and yourself changes And that's no different from, you know, the fact that when we're swimming in a swimming pool or in the sea, for example, our perceptions change as well. And what I mean by that is our senses if you're in the gym lifting weights or running physically you feel different and you're physically noticing those differences and your focus of attention is more on what you're doing and the part of your body that you're using in that moment Or if you're sitting down listening to music, you're focusing on the sound initially. You may not be taking any notice of how you physically feel. You may have your eyes closed, so you're not seeing anything. You're not tasting anything other than maybe just the insides of your own mouth, or maybe, you know, if you've eaten something or had a drink or something, maybe you can taste that. You may be able to smell something, it may be a smell, but chances are you're not noticing it anyway. 
we get used to the odours of our own homes and I can say that with confidence because I live with a ferret and I don't smell him at all I don't smell him anymore but apparently he's a bit stinky at times <laughs> so when your senses are reduced simply because you're not using them at this moment it changes your perception how you experience the world in this moment is different to how you were experiencing the world an hour ago doesn't mean it's any better or any worse it's just different and if you were to be lying on your bed listening to some music then initially you'd have the music there and then perhaps you'd start to connect with the music on a certain emotional level and just to let you know that Andre the ferret is actually in the room at the moment so if you hear any little, little background sounds that's just him he's asleep but he can get a bit restless sometimes he's moves around a bit you know just like we all can do he likes to he likes to be in the room with me when I'm making recordings He's, he's very much a part of this free service that I offer. He's part of every podcast in a certain way. He's, I would say he's the mascot. Andre the Ferret is the mascot of this free hypnosis service. Although I do wish that he'd be completely quiet at times. And the thing is, as you talk about relaxing, just having the subject raised and gently investigating how different situations can affect your level of relaxation and that in turn could 
could lead to making or deciding to make changes. changes that may be useful in order to create more physical comfort in your body and allow any kind of stress physical discomfort to be naturally released so one of the things and I know this is quite old fashioned but anyone that ever had a, a PC in the past you know, a computer, one with a monitor and a tower with it and, you know, a mouse and a keyboard with it all connected and everything. There used to be a thing that you could do called defrag, defrag where you'd defrag the thing. <laughs> and I'm still not 100% sure what defrag is, but basically cleaning up the hard drive so that the hard drive and the computer can work faster so it gets rid of unnecessary unwanted things things that are no longer useful and gets rid of them and frees the hard drive so that it runs smoother and I used to quite like the sound of the computer when it did the defrag because sometimes it would take hours especially if it hadn't been defragged for ages and ages and it would get rid of you know residue from old programs that you used to use in the past stuff that's no longer necessary or useful and in fact could possibly be harmful could be causing disruption to the PC could be causing the hard drive to slow down could even be something that could cause the PC to temporarily break down So, in some ways, I liken the, the idea of just allowing yourself time and space. to relax gives your mind your brain your body an opportunity to almost defrag to
unwind. To maybe get rid of unwanted feelings, unnecessary thoughts. Maybe old, outdated beliefs that are no longer relevant to you or your life. I've decided the Instead of the sound of the defrag from the computer, we've got the sound of a, a restless ferret moving about. That can be the sound of the defrag of your mind. <laughs> and is something actually that I noticed very early on in my exploration of hypnosis and relaxation. And that started in 1998. I was very interested when I first started studying hypnosis in 98 my first interest really went towards pain relief and also relaxing you know one of the one of the first things you learn in hypnosis is how to create the the feeling or how to get in touch with that feeling of relaxation and I noticed how pleasurable you feel when just closing your eyes sitting or lying down and allowing choosing to allow your body and mind to relax deeply. And there's a feeling, a certain sensation. I'm not even sure if I can explain it. Um, It's a timeless feeling. It's a feeling of complete safety. You feel completely safe. There's absolutely no worries at all. In that space, there's nothing. It's worries and concerns and they just dissolve. So you feel safe, feel incredibly relaxed, peaceful. And happy. This, yeah, I would say there's a, a feeling of happiness.
yeah it's it's a different type of happiness it's not the kind of happiness that comes from outside it doesn't come from something really nice having happened you know uh, like a family thing or uh, good news or you know you've reached the goal or you've you know something really great's happened this is a different possibly even deeper happiness and it's not connected to anything outside it's not connected to anything that you've accomplished even though it's a very positive thing to celebrate your accomplishments and you know to focus on those things to be happy about yet in this moment in this moment just feels just feels right you know there's this you don't want anything you don't need anything you don't long for anything there's no voice in your mind telling you negative things about yourself or about other people there's no thoughts about anyone it's almost like other people no longer exist in this moment so that time almost starts to change or maybe a better way would be time no longer exists no past no future no present it's almost that you're beyond this moment the clock stops ticking and you step out of time you feel so relaxed so peaceful really peaceful
feels safe. You feel in this safe place your body can continue to relax even more feel calm so calm so relaxed can enjoy this feeling for as long as you choose. And I'm going to bring this recording to an end. you can open your eyes whenever you want and when you do you will continue to feel relaxed in your body and in your mind and perhaps you will be surprised and how you feel. Take care and remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love.